bless up bless up my viewers welcome back to the channel watch like share comment and subscribe hit the bell if you're new to the channel remember the more you like the video the more youtube recommend it among his algorithm security guard killed at Moby wholesale a security guard was gunned down while at a work at a wholesale in Montego Bay, St. James and Thursday. The E has been identified as 56-year-old O'Neill Williams, otherwise called Willock or Wilcock, of Hermitage District in Battletown, Westmoreland. A motive is not yet established. The police report that Wilson was on the job at Wagon Super Wholesale located along rail lane. When about 4.20 p.m., man armed with a handgun entered the establishment, the gunman opened fire hitting him before escaping on foot. The police were summoned. The scene was processed and Wilson's body was removed to the morgue for post-mortem examination. Crazy, my viewers. Crazy. I will tell us every time we get up, there's another person I get knocked or clapped with. St. Catching Gangster gets six years in prison. Gangster Lisbeth Smith was today sentenced to six years in prison. Smith, last December, pleaded guilty to being a member of a criminal gang and participating in criminal gang. Sentencing was handed down in St. Catherine Circuit Court today by Justice Bertram Morris, who noted that the 25-year-old benefited from his guilty plea. The charge against Smith stemmed from a 2018 investigation by the detectives from the St. Catherine Police Division into activities of Sparta gang in Old Arbor. Yeah, man, the gangsters them, boy, gangsters them forget more years behind bars. That we believe. Gun owner ca accused of shooting man during bar dispute get 500,000 bail. The St. Catherine licensed firearm owner who reportedly shot a man in the face during a dispute at a bar was this morning offered 500,000 bail in the gun court. Businessman Mark Chen, 40, was offered bail by Justice Chester Stam on condition that he report to the Old Harbor Police Station on Monday and Thursdays. He is charged with owning with intent, making use of a firearm to commit a felony and breaches of the terms of condition of a firearm authorization. Allegations are that on February 19, the accused and the complainant had a dispute which become physical. Cheng allegedly brandished his licensed firearm and held the man by his throat and opened fire, hitting him in the face. According to the police, the injured man was assisted to the hospital where he was treated. The police report that Chang later turned himself in and his firearm was seized by the police.